After watching those satanic club Real Madrid yesterday win the UEFA Super Cup, I realized that Barcelona are going trophy this season. You might tell me, what the hell are you saying? What does Real Madrid winning the Super Cup has to do with Barcelona going trophy next season? Well, let me tell you why, my friend. You can't win anything or compete with that kind of a team. I'm not speaking only about Real Madrid, but City, Bayern, while you are having Ter Stegen in the goalkeeper, Lewandowski as a striker, players playing out of position, putting so much pressure on a 17 years old like he is Prime Dino. Brother, we need a team. And yesterday, Real Madrid had a team. Some players weren't performing. That's good. That's understandable. That happens in every team. But other players showed up. Like, I haven't seen Bellingham perform like this since the day he joined Real Madrid. Mbappe wasn't that good, but at least he scored. A performance for Real Madrid doesn't mean sh Vini was good, Rodrigo was out of this game, like, bro, I didn't even notice he was playing, Valverde was cooking, yeah, Courtois was cooking, you see what I'm talking about in here, for you to compete, you need to have a good team, a good bench, as Barcelona, even our f***ing first team is missing a lot of players, let alone the bench, how are we meant to compete for the Champions League when there is mother like this, have you seen that save from Courtois, mm -hmm. imagine with me, that was their sick, exactly, I was shocked yesterday on stream, brother. Brother, by the way, we are watching every Barcelona and Real Madrid game this season. So make sure to subscribe. After watching Real Madrid yesterday, yes, I actually started thinking a lot about Barcelona. I don't understand what's happening. There is probably 10 days left in the transfer window. We need to move because Real Madrid, bro, that team they have, it ain't scary, but looking at that, that team was perfect, balanced in every position. Every position, there is a player that performs good, if not one of the best players in that position even the bench the bench is so good let's not talk about oh Barcelona don't have any money Barcelona have problems and to fix them it's so easy sell them and those problems are Lewandowski and Ter Stegen we can't compete with a striker that can't even run can't control the ball complain about everything dances on TikTok we can't have a goalkeeper that can save a ball and the old mother talking about oh Ter Stegen is a legend yes two seasons he was great but the other he was sh do you want me to just respect him? Yes, I respect him, but right now I don't give a f about him. I want him out of my club. Is that a problem? Like him being a legend for Barcelona doesn't make the difference if he will save the ball or not. His hands don't work anymore. Watching Courtois, even the Atalanta goalkeeper yesterday had some crazy saves. Make me realize how bad Ter Stegen is. Every time I watch a goalkeeper, a normal goalkeeper, I'm not even talking about like great goalkeeper, apart from Onana, I regret having Ter Stegen. And we are losing so many great goalkeepers in this transfer because we don't care. Even sign a goalkeeper just so he can compete with Ter Stegen. How about this? Don't sell Ter Stegen. Keep him. Just so he can compete with other goalkeeper and something move him and motivate him. Now he knows he is untouchable. Who the f will replace him? In Yakipenia, brother, they are the same fing goalkeeper. And let's come back to talk about the game. Mbappe, he didn't have a great start. Let me be real with you. That first half was so bad from Real Madrid overall. Not only Mbappe, Atalanta was cooking. But we know the script. Any team that plays against Real Madrid, they start cooking and they end up losing. It was obvious. But Mbappe, bro, that's not a good look. I know he's playing out of his main position. That's what I'm talking about. He is not a striker. He needs to have runs. He needs space. And look, I know he scored a goal, like I said, but I don't give his performance was so bad, so yeah. Apart from the goal, he wasn't doing anything special. But yeah, it's gonna be a long, long season. I mean, I expect the Real Madrid to cook. They changed nothing Real Madrid. They changed nothing in the way they play. Take the performance, we take the win. With Mbappe, without Mbappe, they will win. So yeah, hopefully Barcelona move. Because there is a trophy season waiting ahead of us. If we stay like this, if we stay like this, yeah. We are going trophies. We need to move. Move Deco, move Laporta.